Hey, it's Casey, and welcome to Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. Um, today, I'm going to go ahead and try to help Sarah out on her personal quest, where she asked us to march through an area. Um, I think it might be time pretty soon to um, unlock a new location and go see what's happening there, but I do think I have a few things left to do in Crestwood, so I'll um, need to finish up there before I try to go somewhere new. So last time um, we completed uh, a quest for Cassandra where we located the Seekers and um, it didn't turn out very well for her so hopefully Sarah's will be better. I hear Vachelle was good pay for you Inquisitor. Time to go see if my friends came through too. Got a location for a stash. Hopefully something nice for my trouble. Well, to your trouble. Just let me know when you're ready to head out. Be sure to bring your empty pockets. Um, who is paying us? Who's putting up the reward for this? I don't know. Sometimes it's past the hat. Sometimes it's, I lifted this from Master's vault. Doesn't matter, does it? Job done. Time to get what we're owed. Okay, let's go. I'm ready if you are. Always, yeah. My favorite part, this. Let's go see what friends can get us. Okay, so let's go with Dorian and Blackwall. I don't think I'm ever going to take out Vivian again. I just don't like her at all. She's so hard to um, enjoy. So <laughs> When I have two other mages, I don't really see the uh, benefit. But maybe I should give her another shot. I don't know. Wait, this is weird. What? I was expecting a village or something. The people that leave me stuff don't trek out to places like this. Give me a city and I'll give you a tour, but surprise, surprise, I don't know stupid woods or ruins. What's that? Don't hurt me. Harmond made me do it. Uh -huh, yeah, of course it's gone wrong. Right, things have gone sour, as they do. No, no, it, it has to go right or he'll kill me for the marching. It wasn't my fault. You were the one with the rumor out of Vachelle. My friend. You're her. You're the one he's waiting for. It's her. She's here. Red Jenny. Ooh. was personally involved. This is a tragic misunderstanding. Who's talking? Let's all sheathe our swords, you walk out, and we'll conduct this like business. Don't believe this piss bag. He started it. Who's he? I don't see anyone. He sounded like he was talking right next to us. Oh, here's a guy. There. That wasn't so hard, was it? We identified the confusion, and we worked past it. I'm Lord Pell Harmond. I do hope, Inquisitor, that you continue to respond to reason. After all, your choice of company is hardly virtuous. Freaking user you are. Another noble prick who punches down. We're the same, you and I. Well, that is overstating it. You are nothing like me. But we both need people. Yeah, that's my ally you attacked. You wanted to talk now, but Sarah is my ally. You attacked her friends. Come now. You know how much her meddling cost me? Because apparently you were complicit. Honestly, previous to this very moment, I thought you'd also been tricked by these red jennies. You're of noble birth, 
And as Inquisitor, you are more than a peer. I attacked them on behalf of us both. Ass biscuit. <laughs> Quiet. Inquisitor, Herald, I don't want to be your enemy. I'm barely invested in being hers. If you are willing to recognize an opportunity, we could be exceptional partners. Um... Yeah, you killed innocent contacts. The servants you killed. They did nothing except talk about what was going on. You killed my contacts. My friends. That is entirely true. Well, that should be that then. You're the one who empowered them, made their complaints a threat. Perhaps you should have warned them about talking to you. Stop talking to him. Really, just stop it. Um... Yeah, I don't want to be his partner, and I don't want him to, uh, serve the Inquisition either. I'll just let Sarah kill him. Just kill him, Sarah. <laughs> uh, I guess she didn't really want to kill him. That? Mother puss bucket friggin' Holy. bastard shite bag piss face! Eat it, you lop-eared son of an arse nut! Sarah! Sarah! Ugh. What? I think he's dead. I think you're done. At this point, you're making wine. Ew. Ugh, that makes it worse. Friends, Inquisitor. Better than his lot any day. Hey, you. Know what? Thanks. Felt good to stomp the smile off that pisshead's face. It doesn't go bad like that often, yeah? But when it does, they deserve it. Um. Yeah, no more mistakes, got it? It was very nearly a disaster. Never again. Well, sure, you deal with shite like... I don't want to hear it. I'm leading too many people to put up with this. You are bloody lucky you're still on my good side. Because I'd... Something. Hey, uh, watch yourself. I need all the help I can get, but consider this a warning. Well, understood. Hop to and all that. If you need me, I'll be waiting for some barking ass to give me orders. So hard to get. Stupid. Everyone. Wow, that turned out um, differently than I expected. I didn't think she would get so mad. Ready for waiting. Um, so is your group still active? Is your network of contacts still active after what happened? After Lord Arsol and Vichel? Of course. He may have killed people, but that just means there's more who hate him. It's crap that he killed people, though. They were just trying to stand up a little. Um, do your pranks achieve much? We annoyed some nobles. Does that really help all that much? It helped make a dead idiot. That's good return for time. I don't get what's so hard to understand. Your stuff works the same. Your inquisition, I mean. Punch a bully, people like you. Do it because they asked, or let them think they asked. They like it even more. It's inspiring, even if it sometimes goes tits up and they take a hit back. You know, like Haven. Yeah, how are you still alive? It must have gone wrong before. How many times have you almost died? What fight were you in? We didn't almost die. Besides, I only have to start these punch-ups. What do you mean? You killed Harmond. Sure, sometimes I plonk one. But you know what it takes to be a noble? Everyone says, he's a noble. That's all a title is. So I slap someone, make them look stupid for just a second. All of a sudden, he doesn't look so nobly or scary. Maybe the servants rebel, whatever. But know what really gets them? Other nobles. They blame the slappy for being slapped. Their shit's like that. So it's backwards inspiration, sort of. Still works like yours does. So you think you inspire like me? So you think that what you Have do is just as inspiring as what I do? I said it works the same. Because if you're boot on your neck poor, 
Nobles and Corius don't look much different. They sure as piss look closer to each other than they do to real people. So yes, I inspire. Little pockets of inspire... Asian. <laughs> I love that she never says Corypheus. <laughs> it's always something else. Um, that's actually a pretty fair point. I get it. Kind of. We just don't think of what you do as that kind of inspiration. Well, we should take a good hard look at where our people come from. All the same people. It's you that's weird. I kind of like it. Surprise to me too, yeah? Okay. We'll talk another time. It's all good, innit? Anything else, Sarah? Sitting and waiting. Great, yeah? Um... I don't even dare go there. Um, so carry on. I'll be back if I need you. Go on. So that had a different outcome than I was thinking it would. Uh, what's the question mark for? Not upstairs. Oh, wait, was it over there? I hope I can help somehow. Maybe cleaning. Nope. <laughs> Inquisitor? Um, how can we use you? Can you think of any other tasks suitable for the charges? Nothing jumps out at me. If I come up with any ideas, I'll let you know. Okay. Um, tell me about the chargers. Can we talk about the bull's chargers? Certainly. What can I tell you? Tell me of an interesting job. Have you had any other interesting jobs? We went up against Gatlas giants in Ferelden. Not actual giants, but big guys. All wearing a dragon's weight and armor. Might as well be fighting golems. The chief challenged Gatler himself to a single combat. Gatler laughed and called him a horned savage. The chief broke a dam and flooded the valley. Last we saw, Gatler was a bunch of bubbles as we swam away. We'll talk later. Oh, it's full. Ah, come on, Krim. I'm working my ass off trying to get you to see that move. You still got plenty of ass left, Chief. Ah, uh, your worship. Glad you came by. I got a letter from my contacts in the Ben Hasrath. Already verified it with red. <laughs> um, should this be private? Do you want to discuss this alone? Not like I was hiding it from my boys. Besides, right now, I need to hit something. You know they've got training dummies, Chief. The training dummy might actually defend itself against the shield bash. Anyway, the Ben Hasrath letter. Um... Yeah, you're supposed to just watch. I was under the impression that you were just sending reports. Yeah, so was I. The Ben Hasrath have been reading my reports. They don't like Corypheus or his Venatori. And they really don't like Red Lyrium. They're ready to work with us. With you, boss. The Kunari and the Inquisition. Joining forces. Um, yeah, I don't trust them at all. That would be an unprecedented offer if I believed it was legitimate. Which I don't. Now, ordinarily, that would be the way to go. But they've identified themselves. They're not running a game on you. They found a massive Red Lyrium shipping operation out on the coast. They wanted us to hit it together. Talked about bringing in one of their dreadnoughts. Always wanted to see one of those big war ships in action. Did you see that? Go get some water. <laughs> They're worried about tipping the smugglers, so no army. My chargers, you, maybe some backup. What are they offering? What does this alliance really get us? They wouldn't use the word alliance if they didn't mean it. Naval power. More Ben Hasrath reports. Gunari soldiers pointed at the Venatori. It could do a lot of good. Something wrong? You don't seem entirely happy about this. No, I'm good. It's... Uh, I'm used to them being over there. It's been a while. 
You don't want them to spread. I thought the Kunara wanted to extend their reach to the whole world. Yeah. Just didn't think I'd see it. Look, the Kuhn answers a lot of questions. It's a good life for a lot of people. But it's a big change. And a lot of folks here wouldn't do so well under that kind of life. I guess it's not like we're converting. This is just us joining forces against Corypheus. On that front, I think we're good. Um, I really don't trust the Canari, but if Bull thinks it's okay, I guess I'll do it. I think the Inquisition could use some help from the Kunari. Good. I'll pass on word to Colin and Red. We can set up the meeting whenever you're ready. Okay. I think, um... Inquisitor. I want to go ahead and plant the, um crystal in the Venatory camp. Um, Mother Giselle said the maker is acting through Calpurnia. That's what I was like blanking out for a second. Um, and do that really quickly. Plant Crystal and Venatory Headquarters. Scrawl note from Arcanus Dagna to Sister Liliana. It's all ready. I tested out the crystal halves and everything one half records, the other receives. Now your spies just have to find the camp, sneak into it, figure out where Calpurnia works, hide the crystal there without getting caught, then sneak out. Piece of cake. D. Uh, Liliana says, this will take time as well as people, Inquisitor, but the reward is obvious, so let us begin. Inquisitor. Also, you know who I haven't talked to in a really long time is Colin. I actually kind of forgot about him. <laughs> so let's go um, see what he's doing. As leader of the Inquisition, you... There's something I must tell you. Um, yeah, you can tell me anything. Whatever it is, I'm willing to listen. Right. Thank you. Lyrium grants Templars our abilities, but it controls us as well. Those cut off suffer. Some go mad, others die. We have secured a reliable source of Lyrium for the Templars here. But I no longer take it. You stopped? When I joined the Inquisition. It's been months now. Um... But why? Why are you doing this? After what happened in Kirkwall, I couldn't. I will not be bound to the Order or that life any longer. Whatever the suffering, I accept it. But I would not put the Inquisition at risk. I have asked Cassandra to... watch me. If my ability to lead is compromised, I will be relieved from duty. Are you okay? Are you in pain? I can endure it. Um... Yeah, I respect your decision. Thank you for telling me. I respect what you're doing. Thank you, Inquisitor. The Inquisition's army must always take priority. Should anything happen, I will defer to Cassandra's judgment. Wow, okay. Um, I want to take a quick peek at that codex entry, actually. Confessions of Illyrium Addict. 
a prison cell, a scrap of paper for my confession, scarce enough bread and water. All I get for skimming one lousy bottle from the lyrium stores. Night Lieutenant Freyan cut my normal rations for insubordination. Insubordination my arse. It's because I saw him desert the guard tower to meet his girl. Fran thought he could teach me a lesson. I'm thirsty, but the water doesn't work. It should be more blue. You take it like medicine at first, Valerium. Your whole body sings with it, like the maker's own fire. You're not scared of anything, not even abominations. After, it even takes away the nightmares. But the, ra the rations? Too small. If they don't give you enough, your hands get cold. The sky starts to press down on you. Little things slip away, so you have to stay. The senior Templars all have that look, that cloudy look in their eyes. Sign your confession, they said. I'm trying. I can't think of what name to sign. Confessions of an unknown Templar found among uh, Mont Saint Mars Chantry records. 827, blessed. So I find it pretty commendable that Colin is trying to um, break the Lyrium addiction. Inquisitor? Um, is there anything I should know? Is there anything I should know? Repairs to Skyhold's fortifications are progressing. Our scouts report no immediate threats in the surrounding area. We are fortunate Solus knew of this place. Um, are you with anyone? Did you leave anyone behind in Kirkwall? No. I fear I made few friends there, and my family's in Ferelden. No one special caught your interest? Not in Kirkwall. Okay, um, tell me about your colleagues. What do you think of the people you work with? Who do you mean? How's working with Josephine? What do you think of our ambassador? We have little in common. How she delights in meeting with nobles all day is beyond me. But I enjoy working with her. Uh, what do you think of Liliana? How do you like working with Leliana? The Inquisition would not exist without her. I may not always agree with her methods, but she's more passionate about our cause than anyone. Cassandra may have declared the Inquisition publicly, but Liliana is just as responsible for its formation. Tell me about our soldiers. Are you satisfied with the Inquisition's forces? Our soldiers are well disciplined and committed to the cause. Theron Falls Templars are adjusting to life here. Their experience will prove useful against the Venatori. I have no more questions. I should let you get back to work. Anything else, Colin? Inquisitor? Anything I should know? Is there anything I should know? I'd gotten used to mages disliking me on principle. Vivienne's views on Templars are surprisingly traditional. That's all. That's all for now. Should you require anything, I'll be here. Okay, so... Um, I think I want to go to Crestwood before I go to the Storm Coast with Fool. And see what I have to finish up there. I know I have some things to do. Oh yeah, that demon. Okay, um, that we killed, I guess it's a spirit that we killed the rage demon for. So let's go and let's take Cassandra, Cole, since I haven't been around with Cole yet because I don't really like taking, um, too many, like, I feel like rogues aren't that powerful, um, to take so many, but should be okay. And since I haven't been dying lately, must be doing alright and solace. Um, let me check out my potions really quick. Be safe than sorry.
It's still really weird to see Crestwood without all the rain. This looks very dry now considering how much it was raining. It's quite dusty. It's a little surprising. harder to see during the day. Yes. Um, why don't you return? Why haven't you gone back to the Fade? I will not be denied. I refuse to leave until something obeys my orders. Any advice for it, Cole? Maybe you can give it some guidance, Cole. Uh, maybe? My name is... Ah, compassion. Did I ask your name? Oh, sorry. <laughs> so she just called him Cold Compassion. That's interesting. Um, so I guess she recognized him. Um, I killed a rage demon for you. The rage demon in the caves is dead, as you commanded. I had no doubts. Now that my sovereignty has been respected, I can depart this unchanging nightmare. Your reward. Use it well. Spirits such as that could not leave here until it had proven its nature. Okay, let's see what else we have to do. Looks like there's a rift down here. What type of that? Go ahead and mark it. Um, I'm trying to decide which one's closer. I guess we'll try from here. Hopefully, it's close enough. I'm Works interested to, to see how we um, do fighting together with this group. I almost always have two mages. What's that over there? I don't think I've been there yet. I'll head there after um, I take care of this rift. Dragon. Is that the same one that um, flew over us as we were leaving the? Um... Oh my gosh! I no 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 no. I don't think I can. I ah. Uh... I don't think I can fight that. to run away. I'll still give it a try and maybe just die. But I am interested to see oh, still too far. I just wanna know how many points you have, what level you are. Oh <laughs> Okay, so 180,000 level 13. I don't think we're gonna make it through this. And Cassandra's already injured somehow. Oh. Okay, Solus. And 
I'm gonna go uh, all out and just mark the red right from the beginning. That is a lot of points we have to get rid of. And Cassandra. Okay. It's going to be very interesting. Oh yeah, it's like barely touching. Doing anything at all. This is going to be bad news. All disabling effects, perceptive, spirit vulnerability. Reviving everyone for her. But you can regenerate Cassandra. Solus, I need you to save up a barrier. Oh, this is bad. Bad, bad, bad. Joke. Yeah, it's like literally, um, no, why would you do that? It's like as soon as someone's revived it, you can die. Andra. Oh, mana. That was terrible. I haven't died in a long time, but that was pathetic. Yeah, I need to stay away from that dragon. I'm not even prepared for that. So let's see how far back I have to go. Hopefully not too far. Okay, so it looks like I came back right here, but I'm going to go ahead and leave because I can't do this. And Liliana's ready, so we're going to run away because I just got thrashed by that dragon like it wasn't even I think it was like five seconds in I think we were all dying so <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and exit the premises and head back to Skyhold um, to take care of under her skin wow okay so that was really embarrassing how badly I just got destroyed by that dragon um, I mean, I wasn't out with the group that I would have wanted to be out with to try to drag in. Um, and I certainly got put in my place for 
complaining yesterday about how much easier I felt like this game had gotten since I had come to Skyhold. And I felt like I wasn't dying nearly as much as I used to or having as many challenging fights. But uh, I just gotta put my foot in my mouth after saying that and just getting destroyed, so yeah. 